cartilage, and it's actually just in tissue that runs down the cartilage. So they're teeth fall out fairly equal. And that's fine, because they're always growing new teeth. Oh, wait, their teeth are always in good condition. Well, it's going on at the end, then, so So these uh, stingrays will not sting. That's one of the things people worry about. Is they going to sting me? No, no. This, these stingrays will not sting you. They do not have a sting. You can actually see that sting if they had it. It's on the dorsal side, so it's on the back of them. It's right past their dorsal fin. So if you look on our stingrays, uh, on their tail, you'll see a very small fin, about the size of a quarter. Right past that is where the sting would be normally. And that sting's about as long as a pinky finger. Uh, so it's a couple of inches long, about a half inch wide. It, it's, if, you, if you get stung by a stingray, it's a pretty large uh, puncture wound, and it is venomous. There is venom that runs along the top of that sting. So it's not hypodermic, it's just the sting is envenomed as it comes out of the stingray's uh, sheath. And, uh, and the, the toxin is painful. It's not, it's not fatal, it's not usually going to kill anyone. But it can be uh, pretty, pretty painful. Now these ones don't have a sting, so you don't worry about them stinging you at all. Usually, what happens if a person gets stung? It's one of the little round stingrays that we have all around here in San Diego, and.